Hey there, welcome back to my channel. Today I have something special to share with you all. You see, life here in Amsterdam has been an incredibly eventful lately, and I couldn't wait to tell you all about it. So grab a cup of something, sit back, and let's embark on this exciting month together. As you might know, in the early weeks of June, I set off on a trip to Georgia to be with my family and friends. Alongside this, I had my bestie around and we casually explored Amsterdam together, strolling in the streets and having picnic in the parks, mostly. We also participated in a group retreat where we collaborate on exciting research projects. It is always a fun experience filled with interesting scientific ideas, visions for the group and teaching, karaoke and board games. I was recently lucky enough to be attending a wonderful science festival near the seaside. Ames' event was absolutely amazing and to my surprise I won a poster prize. Beside all this, incredible experiences, I've also been focusing on my physical and mental well-being. I've ramped up my fitness routine, have been running a bit more every week and try to be generally a bit more active. All this occupied all my free time, leaving no space for content creation, the activity that I enjoy so much. I almost forgot that I got a new bike. Good morning. Today I have a very interesting day, but quite hectic. I have two very important things today. First, I have a live TV interview. I'm not sure yet what I'm gonna talk about. The TV program is called uh, The Narrative of Women. I guess I'm just gonna talk about my, my research, my updates, my future plans and so on. Right away after the call, I'm going to cycle to my uni. I have a few meetings, one with my master student to uh, go through his code and everything because he's finishing up this week. That's quite important. And then in the evening, I've been invited to the tea culture club in Amsterdam, Moiche, for a Chinese tea ceremony and a guided tour. And I'm so excited because I've always been a tea lover. I didn't really drink coffee till I moved to Sweden. They also have some teas from Georgia which is really exciting for me. I don't know if they knew that I was from Georgia when they invited me. This is how I curl my eyelashes till they dry. So it's a bit. So this is my new bike, but there are, there are a few things that we couldn't really do. So this one was adjusted on the wrong side. I think this should be on the right side and the bell should be on the left side. And then we couldn't really install the front light because I think we were lacking one thing and the handbrake needs to be installed. So I have to bring it to the shop to check everything so that it doesn't break apart when I cycle. <laughs> and afterwards it's ready to go. But I'm so happy. I always wanted to get this bike from Veloretti and I'm super excited to cycle, finally. I also have a helmet, so I will show you later. I'm loving it. Today is gonna be fun. Have a job I've been into this program before and I love the interviewer so much. She's amazing. So it of course went 
fine and I talked about my life, my goals, my um, experiences. I also got to talk about my new podcast, so it was great. Uh, the thing is that it took longer than I expected. I knew what time I was going to leave. I had everything planned and then I got distracted and then I got really, really hungry. So I was like, okay, maybe I should prepare something very small to eat before I leave. And then I started preparing and then I started eating and I was like, oh no, no, I have enough time. In the worst case, I just cycle. And I decided that I don't want to cycle today. I just want to walk. So then I left and I left late and there are all these traffic lights and it's raining and it's gonna be a horrible traffic. And now it's starting to rain on top of everything. So I think I'm gonna be late today, but I have an umbrella with me, so I'm safe. The weather cannot be more perfect for tea. And I'm gonna drink a lot of tea today. That's what I'm gonna do. I mean, look at this weather. Ah. Okay, okay, my umbrella is broken. I need to fix it. amazing the tea that i tried so i tried oolong because i've never tried that type of tea before it was delicious and i also got a private tea ceremony and i don't really need more for happiness really my day has been made it's been an amazing day it's a horrible weather it's not horrible actually it was worse before but it's raining and i'm not even complaining about it and also the tea that i drank apparently makes you calm but focused and this is how I feel right now. I feel calm and focused. I could do more work today. So when I get home, I could actually work. What I actually need to do today is to work out. Meet my new baby. I had it checked in the store. They did an amazing job adjusting everything, making sure that it doesn't disassemble in the middle of cycling so I did my first ride and now I'm just strolling home because I don't want to rush I could cycle but it's a nice weather and I haven't really been walking the past few days so I thought that it was a good opportunity one thing that I have to get is another lock before it gets stolen so probably tomorrow I should go somewhere and buy another lock uh, I've never had a bike stolen in my life so I don't, I don't want this to be the first one that ever gets stolen. 